Hi, thanks for coming to the Hop Huckster Hop, the Vintage Stop on the Huckster Hop. <laughs> we are having fun going from uh, shop to shop tonight, uh, sale to sale to see what all wonderful goodies that people have in store. Um, uh, if you haven't purchased from me before, please do go to Vintageress.com and just fill out the form there. That just gives me all the information I need in order to send you an invoice by PayPal. And so that's really helpful if you if you would do that, uh, Vintageress.com. And I ship from Canada. I am in the west coast of Canada. And so I do a flat rate, $8 shipping. Uh, within U.S. or into ca across Canada, if you spend a minimum of $30. Um, the sale, this sale will end on Friday night. And if you, I will send invoices out Saturday. If you pay your invoice right away, it will either go out Sunday or Monday. And weekly live videos on this channel are at 6 o'clock uh, Tuesday nights. I put put out weekly videos or lives uh, at 6 p.m. Pacific on Tuesday evenings. And after this, hop on over to Dolores or Dolo at Miss Dam's Jewel Miss Dam Jewelry. She's going to have some wonderful things for you to look at. And all the links are down below in the description box uh, to all the participants in tonight's Huckster Hop. So do check everybody out. They will have, still have things available. And you can go back and shop the hop. So if, without further ado, shall we get started? It is a signed dish. So this is a Mary Mug collectible. Very cute little dish with some chicks coming out of their, their nest. And it is signed um, uh, 1977 Mary Mug. Um, so it's a really great little piece. This is $9, $9, and, oh, and I do price in, in U.S. dollars, sorry. Nine U.S. dollars, the letter C, C for carrot, if you'd like this dish. The next thing I have is a super cute turtle, and it's milk glass, uh, milk glass turtle, with a little gold kind of eyes and a little mouth there. And it is a good brand. It does Colport. Um, in, from England. There we go. It's focusing in for me there. So cool port for England. And isn't he, he's got this grimace on his face. It's just, he's just cute. He's cute. So he's also $9, $9. And he's the letter H, H for hooray. Hooray for the turtle. <laughs> okay. So that's the cold port turtle. Now I've got a uh, Number of critters tonight. This one made me laugh when I found it. So it is a little black pottery, uh, probably, I don't know, it could be Mexican or it could be um, not Pe like Pueblo Indian as well. But this is a little bit different than just a figurine. Do you see the holes? So what this is, is a whistle. And I just kind of <laughs> had a chuckle because. This is a donkey, or what's the other name for a donkey? <laughs> and I'm going to be blowing on the donkeys. <laughs> Isn't that fun? <laughs> so you yeah, get to blow on an ass of an ass. <laughs> oh, this little black pottery <laughs> donkey whistle is $6, $6. And it's the letter J for Joni, J for this fun little whistle. <laughs> then I have some glass for you. I have these very pretty depression glass candlesticks. They're in great shape. Uh, they're amber, um, Ellie Smith, moon and star. And they are $18, $18. And it's the letter M for moon. And letter M for Moon in the in the comments if you'd like these beautiful candlesticks. Oh, wait till you see what I found next. This is one of those things where you find it and you run to the shelf and you grab it before, right? No, anybody else does. 
Look what I found. And I have two of them for you. Two. Cheers. <laughs> two. <laughs> and they are ter uh, Termo Crista, which is the Mexican or sometimes Brazil um, kind of brand of um, milk glass, similar to Fire King and those others. People collect these because their patterns are so wonderful. And these are amazing. I don't know. Hope you can see, like, there's no dishwasher damage. There are, look like they're brand new, never used. And, uh, yeah, so I'm going to give you the two of these. These two orange mugs, $20. $20, which is a steal. I've seen them go for, like, crazy, like $60. Uh, $20 and the letter A, the letter A in the comments. If you'd like these milk glass mugs. Oh, I have the fun, really fun thing next. I've got it here right beside me. I've got to be kind of careful bringing it up because it's tiny, tiny, but oh, so cute. Look at this. So this is a little tea set on a little tray. Now, let me show you each piece here. So there's a, a, um, a little blue and white, and it's got floral on one side. And it's got a, a windmill on the other. It's not marked at all, but it's super cute. Little lid on there. So that's the teapot. And then there are two little cups and saucers. The saucer's just plain with a blue rim. And the cup, what's the cup have on it? It has the windmill little, the little windmill pattern. And then the windmill pattern on the creamer. And then, what does this sugar dish have? Whoops. Uh-oh, the lid just <laughs> went inside. There it goes. Okay. Again, it's a little windmill pattern on that as well. And then, so there's two cups and saucers. And then there's this really pretty tray with the flowers on it. Isn't this sweet? Now, what's interesting is they have a price sticker on the back. So I guess it was originally $12. <laughs> $12 for this little set. And guess what? I'm charging you $12. $12 US for this little set, all these pieces. And if you'd like this little cutie set of, for, you know, really neat little display, great for a uh, dollhouse or just, just a nice little display, $12, the letter N, the letter N, like neat, neat little set of cups and saucers little tea set oh the next thing i found made me think of katie from vintage and vinyl <laughs> isn't this cute it's a little bow tie rhinestone brooch is that not sweet bow tie rhinestone brooch not super big would look so cute uh, you know, if you had a nice white blouse with a collar and you could put this little bow tie, wouldn't that look sweet? Um, it is definitely got some age on it. You can sort of see on the back, you know, that it's kind of worn with some age. There's no signature or anything, but uh, really nice, really good condition. So this black and white uh, rhinestone bow tie brooch is $18, $18. And it's the letter G. The letter G for great. This is a great little bow tie. I got some more critters. I got some more critters. So this is a set of a horse. Really cute little horse. Porcelain horse. He's got a nice expression on his face too. Let's see if we can get it to focus on that. On his kind of like he almost looks like he's grinning. Does he not look like he's grinning? So there's the horse and he's amazing. Like you'd, you'd think his ears would be broken off. They're a tiny bit rough at the top, but I don't see, you know, like it's amazing. Even the tail, like, you know, it's amazing. So, and he's not marked Japan. Uh, no, I don't see any markings on him, but I'm assuming he's a Japan piece. And then I have a cow. So a cow, this is a set, and the cow's little lying baby, a little baby to go with him. 
And then the cutest little mouse with the biggest ears. <laughs> Very kitschy. Sorry, hard to show you him. There we go. And he's kind of black in the back. Now, does he have any chips at all, even his ears? Let's check his ears. No, you know, and he's got the sweetest little blue eyes. You see his little blue eyes? So darn cute. Now, the proportions are a little bit off. I mean, I don't think the mouse would be <laughs> as big, you know, and the horse is kind of bigger than the cow, but, you know, you can put them in different places. So this set of critters, uh, the yeah, a four-piece set, and it is $15.15 for the barnyard kind of grouping. Okay. Then I have a really cool old 1950s-ish, I would say, um, ice, icing pump, squirter, press, icing press. I think I'm going to call it an icing press, icing tube. Um, and if you don't know how this works, so you unscrew this and you fill it up with icing. And then this is the plunger that kind of pushes the icing down and out the tip. And to, to change the tips, you just unscrew this top. And then there's the tips. And I've got a whole set of different tips. So this is like the writing tip where it's just a hole. I'll just put this one back on just to keep it together. But then there are, oh my gosh, there's lots. There are how many? There's, you know, a, a big rosette. There's um, a curved kind of one to make petals. Um, there's a smaller little star. There's this one that has the, it's kind of straight, but then it has that little blip at the middle for, I think that's the use to make leaves. And then there's four more sort of littler ones. Again, similar. Um, yeah, so there's lots, lots here. And there's a bonus one that's not part of this set, but I'll throw it in because it was just in with it. Um, so that, so this icing tube and all of the, the bits to go with it. Um, really good for soft Play-Doh too. You can really, really fun for toddlers. You can put in really like a, a softer Play-Doh and they can squish it out and make all sorts of fun stuff. $12, $12 and it's the letter I. I for icing, I for icing. Okay, next, I have a rubber ducky. <laughs> Here, see, I said critters tonight. Isn't this cute, 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 cute little rubber ducky? And I have two little rubber pigs. This is barnyard night, isn't it? Yeah, because even with the, the donkey too, right? Okay, so then there's these cute little, two little, Piggies, little rubber piggies as well. Okay, so the two piggies and the duck, six dollars, six dollars. Guess what? Letter D for duck. Letter D for duck. So the next thing I have is this really great little rhinestone brooch, and it's a rainbow of color. So there's like all different. Where there's red, there's green, there's blue, there's pink. Uh, really, really pretty. Here's the back of it. So you can see that it has the rivets, an older piece. And it's, you know, about this size. Great for gay pride. Um, and then this is, let's see. Is it, oh, it's not going to work. $15. And it's the letter K for carrot. K for, yeah, carrots. Carrots of diamonds. There we go. <laughs> okay, K. Um, and the next thing, I, oh, this is really pretty. I got this at a garage sale recently and I just was, I'm enamored by this pattern. So this is called, um, the rainbow pattern. And I hope you can tell, but it is, it's kind of ombre. Like it, it fades from white to turquoise. 
maybe the saucer, you'll be able to see it a little bit better, okay? And this is the set from Royal Albert. So it's an old Royal Albert teacup. Um, and it's the rainbow, isn't it rainbow? Yeah, rainbow pattern. The rainbow pattern. And if you've never seen this pattern before, Google it because it is one of the prettiest tea sets and then a really fun one to collect. It comes in pinks and purple and yellow and all different colors. And you can collect like a rainbow of all the different teacups. So this would be the first in your set if you wanted to start collecting these. Great Mother's Day gift. That's what I thought. And that's why I'm bringing it tonight. So this Royal Albert Rainbow Turquoise Cup and Saucer, $18, $18. And it's the letter B, B for Bob, B for Bob for this really pretty rainbow. And that's a good deal for it too. So um, then I have a really fun book. So I have a book of kids easy to sew uh toys and gifts and it's all black and white uh, oh oh <laughs> there's patterns somebody's cut i guess and are traced and cut i'll grab all of those pieces and include it with it as well but it's a lot of like little stuffed animals uh what else can i show you um tablecloths other things to you know Great graphics, because I believe it's from the 50s. Let me just check. Uh, let's see. 1945. 1945. So their patterns are all here. The instructions are all here. Dolls. This, like, really cute little horse. Um, yeah, and there's bits and pieces that are falling out that somebody's traced. Uh, drawstring bags. All sorts of neat things. So toys and gifts from 1945. Look at that price, 15 cents. What can you get for 15 cents now? <laughs> so this a uh, this um, easy to sew toys and gifts, nine dollars, nine dollars, and it's the letter O. O for oh my goodness, these are good. Oh my goodness. Oh, and then I have, who likes Hawaii? <laughs> Do we have any Hawaii fans? Because this is a great thing for people that like Hawaii. So this is a palm tree brooch. And it's really a nice one. It's kind of, it's all gold, gold tone. And it's quite, you know, it's brushed. It would really stand out on a black piece of clothing, as you can see here. So this, this gold palm tree nine dollars nine dollars and it's the letter s s for super duper super duper and then i have somebody's taken a long time to create a very pretty beaded necklace look how long that is oh i should measure that for you too um but it would you know it's great because it can go over your head and you can bring it around twice if you want you know, to give you a sense right um or you can leave it long, you can do one short, one long, whatever you want, okay? And there, here's how it's been kind of been beaded as like little flowers and then, then the long beads as well. And I'll just do a quick measurement here. It's about 30 inches, 30 inches long. Oh, actually 30 and then twice, so 60. <laughs> 60 inches long, 60 inches long. Okay, so that, this um, blue beaded necklace, the blue beaded necklace, $9, $9, the letter R, the letter R for rainbow. So the last thing I want to show you is that I've been creating some really fun little uh, slow stitch or little Oh, uh, uh, crafting like fabric art kind of little kits. I did a video about it on on Tuesday night. So have a look at that video. And so tonight I thought I would bring two really small little kits. The ones that I'm putting up on Etsy are quite a bit bigger, but I thought I would throw together a couple of small ones um, just for you. And so they're only $6. They have a little bit of variety of, you know, a little piece of hanky, 
little piece of fabric, a little medallion of crochet. There's some little flowers, buttons, that kind of stuff. Really cute for, you know, a crafty person that you know of. Maybe just a little treat in a card would be nice for them or on top of a present or something. Um, so these are 12, or sorry, not 12, $6 and the letter P. So these are $6 and the letter P. If you'd like one, just put the letter P in the chat. Okay. Well, thank you so much for coming. Come on over to Miss Dam Jewelry. And Dolo will have some great stuff. So go check her out. The link is in the description below. Thanks so much for coming. You know I love ya. Bye now.